Good morning everybody, my name is Harpo and welcome back to another episode of Sky Factory and I messed up a little bit, I guess. I tried to record this episode a few days ago and I got through about half of it, about half the episode. I got done with half the things that I wanted to do and I was waiting for some uh, sugar candy to grow because I needed paper for a book and I just said, you know, I'm going to cut the episode, or cut it here and I'll finish recording uh, tomorrow or something and I recorded a couple of Survivor games after that. Whenever I went to check if all the footage that I recorded that day was there, uh, the Sky Factory footage, I couldn't open it, I couldn't do anything with it. It was just kind of there, not doing anything. So I didn't really know what to do, and I was too lazy to look up how to fix it. So I just scrapped it, and I said, you know, I'll record it later, and I'll just kind of make a, do a recap of what I did, and do what I was going to do, and kind of make it a shorter episode, just, just cause. So, in that episode, the lost episode. Uh, we got into Darkcraft, as you can see. Made a couple of items. We got some forest trees. And so I'm gonna kind of recap what happened in that episode. Uh, first thing that we made was a uh, force rod. Uh, not that well. I guess they're all the same. But to make a force rod, uh, to start out, you need uh, force uh, ingots and force nuggets and a normal stick, and you'll get kind of a dead force rod, but uh, you know, it's all you need. You just need to use it once or twice uh, to make the force uh, force ingots. You're going to need. Uh, let's grab some. I believe it's just grab one, and I think two iron or two gold uh, you can use, or you can uh, cook iron to get, I believe, like refined iron or something, or some dark craft iron or something. And you just put it like this, and then like this, uh, and you get. Uh, two force ingots, that's from iron, gold you get three, and the dart iron, uh, the cooked iron or whatever, you also get three, so uh, I'll just go ahead and make that. I don't really need it, but whoa, that's a tall tree. But yeah, uh, then you get a uh, slightly used, well, heavily damaged force rod, and uh, with that, you take a, a normal sapling, put it in the crafting table with the force rod, and you will get a force sapling right here, and then you let that grow, and you get these force trees, and then you get the force logs, and the force planks and the force sticks, and then you can start making the uh, full durability force rod. And from there, you can start making all the other items like the force infuser. The force infuser, let's pull this up real quick. At start. There. Uh, where's the force infuser right here? It is a force rod and an enchantment table. So pretty simple to make, but uh, so you have that. But it needs power, so I, I made a force engine, but I don't think I'm going to use it, because uh, there, there are better ways of getting power. We might use generators, so we're going to get into that uh, a little bit in a few minutes. But uh, it's pretty simple to make just force ingots, glass, piston, and force gears, which is just force ingots around a piece of iron. Yeah, pretty simple to make. So, to get started with all of that, I, well, the, the mod recommends that you make this book, the Book of Medora or something, and it requires a bookshelf. Uh, if we can find it. A bookshelf and a force rod. So I had to make a lot of paper. And I didn't have very much sugar cane. I only have three left and there should be growing over here. Yeah, you can see them right there. I only have three left and that's so I have to let those grow and I can expand that farm a little bit. But yeah, this uh, this gives you a, basically a really general overview of all the different uh, items and things that you can do. What is this? Force torch. Yeah, uh, where was I? Yeah, so I made that. That kind of helps me along, uh, guides me through, uh, guides me through Darkcraft. So yeah, I made that. Uh, next, I needed to make a upgrade tome, and that kind of what will help you get started with all of the uh, weapons and armor that Darkcraft has to offer. But um, we'll get into that in just a second. First, I want to make a better power source. I want to make, this is a machine, let's put it in the machine's chest, which is right here. I want to make a generator. I don't know which one I want to make, but I want to make a generator. Generator. Survivalist generator. I feel, feel like that'll be powerful enough. Furnace generator, we could. It's a lot of iron though. Uh, ender generator, I don't, well, I could, but I don't really want to. I don't have that many ender pearls. Heated redstone, uh, it's a lot of, lot of, lot of redstone. I definitely do not have that much. 
culinary generator, which I think uses food. Potions generator, which I didn't even know existed until like a couple seconds ago. I believe there was one, a lava generator? Was there not? There it is. A lava generator, which I'm guessing uses lava, and I have infinite lava, so I think we're going to make this one, which is a furnace, two redstone, a block of iron, and some gold. I can do that. So what was it? Two gold? Nope, five gold. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, block of iron. One, two, three, four, five, six, nine. Uh, two redstone. Here it is. And then, what was it? A furnace. All right. Let's go right here. Let's make a furnace. Boom. Nope, we gotta do this first. Block iron, put that there, put that dun 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 dun. Lava generator, fantastic. Alright, let's put that right there. And uh, yeah, I guess you just fill it up with lava, pretty simple. I have a uh, mucho mucho lava. Now with that, to connect it to the uh, infuser, we're going to need a conduit. I think we'll just make, what was it, leadstone? Yeah. Yeah, lead, glass, some redstone. So I think I have some glass over here. Yes, I do. I have lead in here. Yes, yeah, I have some lead right here. There's two lead and then six redstone. One, two, three, five, six. Awesome. Oh, gotta go to sleep. Gotta make this first. All right, put that there. Can't really see that glass. All right, there we go. Got that. Go to sleep, then we'll get started on this. My dog's walking around. Stop walking around. Just lay down. Good boy. Lay down right next to me. Okay, so. Boom. Now. Uh, what is it? Lava? And then I'm gonna grab some force buckets. No. I don't know. Uh, let's grab these lava buckets. And then we'll grab these empty buckets. And we'll go get some more lava. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Indiana Jones. Dun, 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 dun. Wow, I can fill up four buckets. Awesome. Okay. So let's fill this up. How much is that? All of it. Power level. Let's go for over 9,000. Okay, so this is slowly getting power. I'm going to put those right there. And now I need what? Uh, liquid force. So let's grab. You can. Can you use force shards in those? Yeah, you can. All right, so let's get rid of a couple of these. And by a couple, I mean like all of them. You can get those pretty quickly. All right. So now we have. Uh, now we have power. Now we have liquid force. Perfect. That's still rising. That's going pretty slow. All right. Cool. Bunch of random facts. All right. So I believe you just put the upgrade tome right there. Ooh, look at that. Create heat. And then we can, uh, now we have is it two slots open. We can put our item in there, and then we can add upgrades. Awesome. So, I think I just want to get. Let's do. Let's do a sword. Why not? Let's get some sticks. No, I need force. Force sword. No, it's not a force sword. I misspelled force. Force sword. Yeah. Okay, so I have that. And lava. And I believe that takes um, what is it? that seven attack damage. Wow, so much as a diamond sword. And I believe it takes what is it? Uh, where are they? Claws, I believe, is what it takes. And that adds sharpness, I believe. So let's plop that in there and then go boom, boom, go.
damage too. Okay, so I'm just gonna assume that means sharpness, but uh, does that? It doesn't tell me how much that brings the attack damage up. That's okay. We successfully made our first Darkcraft weapon. That's awesome. So next, uh, am I? How much does this have left? Next tier is 66. Okay. Next, I want to work towards Darkcraft armor. I want to be able to fly, but I'm not quite sure what um, is used to make you fly. I believe it's feather. No, I don't know. I'd have to do. I'd have to do a lot of research. There's a lot I don't know about this mod. I'm just doing the basics right now. Uh, getting the thing powered. Getting uh, just doing some really basic, uh, basic stuff. Basic magic and stuff. But yeah, I think that'll end this episode here. Or that I'm going to end this episode here. I want to get uh, some other things recorded right now. I want to do some survival games. I want to get like five recorded just so I have them. If I don't have anything else, I can just fall back on those and upload those. But uh, yeah, this will do it for this episode of Sky Factory. Next episode, we'll definitely start getting a little bit more advanced into uh into darkcraft with the armor and maybe we'll do like other tools so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and thank you all for watching have a great day and i'll catch you next time goodbye